the ai race is no longer just about companies anymore so it's not just open ai versus google versus meta anymore it's countries its alliances and its power and the uae just made a historic move introducing stargate uae the first international deployment of open ai stargate infrastructure it's a nation scale ai data cluster built in partnership with g42 open ai oracle nvidia Cisco and SoftBank. And yes, it's fully backed by the US government. So let's break it down. What is Stargate? So Stargate is OpenAI's vision to build frontier-scale AI infrastructure across the world. And not just for ChatGPT, but to power the compute needs of future AGI systems. And the UAE becomes the first country outside the US to host one. and it's not small it's a 1 gigawatt ai data cluster 200 megawatt that's going to be live by 2026 and up to 5 gigawatt campus expansion in abu dhabi and this is within a 2000 mile ai coverage radius which is half of the world's population so experts said that other countries are going to scramble now this is a new ai land rush and this move echoes open ai's project target origins in Alabama in Texas which is a 500 billion initiative with 8 buildings 400000 gpus and support from oracle and softbank the project began with skepticism and is now seen as the largest infrastructure build in modern history with the uae deployment expanding its global reach but why the uae and why now look the country offers three critical advantages which is energy huge supply to power hyperscale compute then geopolitical neutrality which is a trusted partner across west and the east the country has pledged 1.4 trillion dollars to us aligned ai chips and compute and this launch event had them all from president sheikh mohammed crown prince sheikh khalid open ai sam altman nvidia's jensen huang softbank's masayoshi son cisco oracle g42 and this is not just a data center because it's a strategic signal and uae's partnership isn't just technical it's mostly political because it complements the us uae ai acceleration partnership and secures america's influence over global ai rails while allowing the uae to become a regional ai leader but open ai is going for different countries and what's the big deal look the stargate uae is also the first initiative under open ai for countries and it's a global effort to localize ai access and this enables sovereign ai compute build democracy aligned ai grids and support localized chat gpt instances while also helping launch ai startup funds so think of it as aws meets foreign policy except this time it's about ai supercomputers over 30 countries have already expressed interest and open ai jason kwan is kicking off a global road show across asia pacific and countries like india japan south korea and australia can be next but what does this mean for the world look ai is becoming an essential infrastructure layer and unlike last time this isn't built nation by nation it's being coordinated across allies and the uae becomes the first country with nationwide chat gpt access and a regional compute powerhouse for ai services and the middle east's entry into agi ready infrastructure meanwhile african nations are noticeably absent from the table so what about india look a country over 1.4 billion people a thriving tech talent pool and rising ai aspirations india has announced the india ai mission with a budget of over 10000 crores and it's also launched its compute portal offering 18000 plus gpus and introduced ai kosh which is a high quality data repository it's even planning to build home grown gpus and 3 nanometer chips so what is india's strategy it is to build cost efficient and india centric ai through public and private partnerships but here's the gap while the intent is quite strong there is no stargate scale project yet so if india wants to lead this century's digital economy it can't just focus on regulations or startups it needs a sovereign compute at scale because this is no longer about which model is smartest it's about which country can build the fastest and stargate uae isn't just the first because it's the blueprint and if you're wondering why this matters ai isn't the product infrastructure is 
This is Front Page by AIM TV. Like, share and subscribe and always remember to think AI and think AIM.